All right, guys, welcome back. This game has been awesome. Kana Bridge of Spirits. I'm going to tell you right now, I've played a lot of games, obviously, in the last 11 years of my life. Some that I liked, some that I didn't. Most of the ones I did try to play, I liked. This is one of those ones I really, really enjoy. And I feel like even if I wasn't recording, I'd be playing it, you know? So thank you guys so much for joining me. We're only on part three. You want more of this game? Just destroy that like button. Now let's get it, guys. Here it goes. Just wanted to check that out for a second. It's like Jedi Fallen Order sliding. I like it. Oh no. What is this? I'm assuming we'll get a, an, an ability with the rot to like increase the arrow damage or make it like crazier. Oh no. Yo, look at my health bar now. Actually, way better. If I had a mouse and keyboard for this, I'd be doing a lot better. Oh, no. Yo, look at this thing. Let me down! Okay, that's a lot of damage. Okay, the swatting away definitely doesn't help. It's like on the elbow. Oh my god. I might die here, guys. Might be GG! Hold on. Okay, that's actually scary. Uh. I don't know what to do here. Use rod, I guess. All the spots. Hold on. I wish there was a way to get health back in combat, you know? Alright, here we go. Shoot the weak points. I don't know if it really matters. I mean, the one on the eyes, obviously. Okay, the throwing part. I need to be more cautious of that. Yo, what? I thought I dodged there. Easy does it. Die here again, guys. Come on, arrow. One more. Got it. Okay. Woo. A little bit worried there for a minute. So we collect all these. There. 
style points. I like that shooting in midair is pretty awesome. All right, at least get the house. Good to go. woods and I tried my best to teach him the old ways consumed by the troubles of our village I was not there for Taro when he needed me most I hope we can bring him peace more relics are hidden in the corruption of the forgotten forest I'll wait for you there We got a knife, a relic discovered. Now we're going to the Forgotten Forest. Um, see if we have any other things here we can investigate. I really wish I could go back down that slide going up to the boss because it was like something on the edge that I could shoot, which maybe I still can, but I don't think so actually. So where it says we need to go. Um, now I could fast travel. I don't mind going on foot. The game's not huge, so it's like it's not really that big of a deal either, either way. But um, yeah, like going back up this is—I don't think we can, unless I teleport. Now that I just realized it, I want to do that again. Uh, too far from Warp Shrine. Oh, you actually need to be next to one. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, let's talk to them really quick. When they talk, and it's not the cutscene, it- the dialogue is very quiet. I'm not sure why. It's good to be back. Yeah, I wish Taro was here. I'm going inside the house. Alright, let's see. Go in here and steal everything. All right, let's see. All right. There's a lot of stuff in here. It's probably the first time I ever played Jack and Daxter. They're like the same kind of, like figuring everything out, but it's a fun game, you know. Yeah, I like stuff like this. There's a lot of little hidden items in here. Hold on. I have enough to upgrade one of my... What is this one? Hold on. Bind multi-shot. I need 200 for that. When shooting an enemy will split nearby enemies, really. And it's just automatic. Oh, that's... You gotta have that. Like, I have to. The parry? I don't... See, I'm not really sold on the parry yet. I'm not sure how we get the rot level to. I think it's just finding, because right now it says we're on 1, 9 out of 10. One more rot, and I think we level up. Okay, now we can go back over here. I want to try this really quick. Might be a little bit out of the way, but it was down this slide right here. I'll show you guys. It's like coming up right in here somewhere. I'm not sure what this was. I just wanted to check it out. Not sure if that was the right thing to do or not. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's just more of that. Okay. Okay. I guess the more you know now. All right, at least we got that. That would have been bothering me for a while if I didn't get it. All right, so we're just going straight towards, I guess, we got this way we could go. What is back here? See a statue that's glowing. Need something that goes there. 
Interesting. See that over there? Oh, they push it back. Okay, let me bring it forward then. And then by doing this, it should spin because I'm interacting with it, right? No? That looks like you could grab onto it, doesn't it? Hmm. We'll look around here really quick. Oh, wait a minute. What is this? Is that a rat? Oh, it is! Let's go, baby. Level two time. There we go. Let's get it. Rock can now perform more actions. Let's see the upgrades now. Yo, look at this one. Start combat with one rot action available. That's a passive trait. And it's huge, too. Okay, I gotta see this aerial one. This has been bothering me a lot. I've been wanting to do a slam. Mm, I feel like this is so strong. Can fire five arrows before the spirit bow must recharge. The parry thing I'm not too, like, sold on. Even the inhale. Like, I never just stand there. I'm always, like, running around. Um... Ooh, hold on. What in the world? Oh, you do get an ability. A rot ability for the bow. Rot infused arrow. Powerful shot that pierces through enemies. It's actually pretty awesome. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Uh, what is this last one? With precise timing to deal massive damage. Oh, so you release it at the right time. Alright, I feel like order of attack... We should get the bind multi-shot first because it just looks absolutely broken. I feel like that's something they'll patch down the road. Uh, then we'll get the air slam. Then we'll get this. I'm not going to plan it out. We'll figure it out. All right. Let's get out of here. New rot hat available. I think this is the right way. We've already talked to them. Yeah, we're going down this way. I would fast travel, but I, I just want to, like, explore a little bit more. I feel like the game is so fresh, you know? Like, I would have missed this. Hold on. What is this? Over there. Now we can move it over here. Now, this should make something we need. Hold on. Uh, was there anything back over here we could destroy? Oh, it was back up in the middle. Hold on. Let me see something really quick. I'm not sure, actually. Um, I remember we went over here, but it was like this path back here. There was like some stuff on the wall, I think. If I'm, not, if I'm remembering correctly, I could be wrong. Oh no, it probably got, probably changed from when we actually did everything. Let's release, hold on. Yeah, I don't think anything's down there. Yeah, because I think originally this was cut off because, way to kill this boss anyways. So I'm not sure why that's even there then. I would imagine, uh... Imagine it's useful for something, so at least we have it unlocked. My thing is, I don't know what it's useful for. Going down the right way, at least. I would think maybe the only thing is useful. Maybe there's something on the other side of this I didn't see. I just want to check really quick. Hold on. Oh, what is this? Uh, where can they move this to? Hmm. Not over here, that's for sure. I'm trying to think like where they could take this. Initial thought was on top of something, but let's just see what happens. See that over there? He's rot. Hmm. I don't know. It's like, there's two things here. There's 
summoning this, then there's the other thing. I don't quite know exactly what I need to do with either of these yet. Hmm. I don't know. We'll come back later. Let's keep on the main path, shall we? I don't know where to move that to. I was thinking like over in here somewhere, but it wouldn't make sense because there's nothing over here. It's like there's uh, it's always like little statues for no no reason in particular. Let's go across. <laughs> I'm not gonna make it. Okay, I, there's something I gotta shoot right there. That's fine. Just glad the loading times doesn't really punish you. I could see you have to bring something over here, maybe. That would be one thing where... Let me go ahead and collect this. Like how they're all just chilling. <laughs> Can you pick that up? Nice. 180. And we got two of those little... Things too. I didn't realize that until now. What I like is this game. It's like I wouldn't say it's made for like kids or anything. It's more just like it's laid back and it's not like super serious. But at the same time, it also isn't really easy. You know what I mean? Not. I don't really know how to actually describe it. There's like a difference between like made for. Oh yeah, hold on. Be on the lookout for another thing I can shoot. Just in case. Oh yeah, the water. <laughs> I forgot. That's not open yet. Nah. I bet I can get over there, but I don't think I can... I don't think I can go down here. Hold on. This water's gonna kill me. Wait, what? I guess certain types of water. Look at him floating. <laughs> just chilling. Alright, we're good. Uh, let's see. Could have fast traveled there. We're just gonna go around here and go to the left. No, this is something okay. So they eat that. I don't know what that does though, other than just replenish. Oh, it gives me five per. Hey, I need five more after this. 195. Let's go. Five more, and then I can um, get the upgrade I actually want. Let's go across. So the game just kind of keeps building onto itself with your abilities. Now you can kind of go back to an era you've already been, and it's actually better. Like, your abilities are going to help you do, like, something completely different. Oh my god. I was not prepared for that. Hold on, let me just back up because I'm like actually struggling a little bit. Take him out. Got him. I don't know why I was kind of caught off guard right there a little bit. Wasn't quite prepared for the challenge we just had. We can go down through here. Um, let me get let me get that ability now. Yeah, because imagine if I was shooting the boss right there. I wouldn't call it the boss, like the little mini boss. That would have made things a lot easier. All right, I'm gonna go through. Let's go through this side. Going straight. Following the icons, I'm guessing there's like an overall story, and then after the story, maybe. You... Oh, hold on. Then you're. Uh... Those three 
see right there. Hmm. So how can I get down there, I wonder? That is the right way to go, right? I feel like that's the only way to get through there. Unless you... Oh, unless you go here. And then go around. But I don't know if that would be the right way or not. I'd just be kind of guessing at that point. Kind of absorb the game for a minute. Just kind of chill. If you guys like a full series of this, by the way, just keep all the support up. I really am enjoying this a lot. I don't see why I would stop. I just, I really enjoy it. Just, and it's fun to play. Easy to, well, I would say it's easy to record. It's the same as every other game, but it's not as complex as something like Deathloop, you know? <laughs> so, just hop over this. around there. I mean, maybe we can go up here and go to the left. I'm assuming that I have to go a different route because it looks like that's the only way. It's got to be a puzzle I can do right here. I just don't know what yet. Hmm. Are one of those things I could bring up? That would be too far. I would imagine they would not do something like that thing I could have picked up earlier, you know? Interesting. Hat cart discovered. Let's go. Looks like you can scale right there, too. Nets. What if you can shoot these? Guess not. New fox rot hat available. And it costs a hundred. I don't know why. I need three more hats. Get three of those. Oh, yeah, they all equipped now. I want to make sure all of them have a hat. The golden rot definitely makes me think it's one I haven't picked up yet. I don't know why. It's like it confuses me just a little bit. All right, here we go. Well, that, was, that was a dead end. Hmm. I don't think the hats do anything yet. Maybe we'll find out something later on down the road, but we shall see. Seems like I'm missing something. I do feel like I should be going back over here and then coming around. You know? I think I think we need to go there. I need to go back to a warp shrine really quick. Because it wouldn't make sense otherwise. What on, what is this? It's like it's only there was something like simple right here I could interact with or bring back over here. Because my assuming is it's like that last time where I needed to get something to bring it back. And... Can't really do that in this section it feels like. Yeah, let's go back. Let's just head back to the little town area, I guess it is. Or the other campfire symbol. We'll loop around and go from there. Even if it's like the scenic route, I'm fine with that. I do like that now that I have the arrow, I'm kind of looking up more. Is this other one? this <gasps> let's go baby hiding up under a tree log I'll take it nice 35 to the next level oh my goodness that is a lot I can't go up there it's like it slides you down Kind of just absorbed into the song a little bit, you know? Granted, I hope it's not copyright, uh, <laughs> copyright, uh, issues there. We'll see. Oh, hold on. Let's destroy this. 
So I probably should have fast traveled, but I like to explore a little bit. Especially when the game is so fresh, you know? And I just got all these brand new abilities. Got a ribbon. Hmm. Not sure what the point of collecting all the hats is. Maybe if there's something they give me that I don't know yet? We'll see. I don't see where there would be a path to go here. It literally looks like there's no way unless this goes to it, but I, I don't see anything. I literally think it has to be... I'm at... Two out of four on that one. I think this is the only way. It has to be that. Because going back through here, I don't see anything else. Doesn't make sense. What we can do is we can warp back, I guess, to the other side. Yeah, because I, I don't... I'm not seeing, like, where else I could go from this. Let's go back to this one. Kind of just take it easy there. This game is a lot to explore, too. I'm just kind of soaking it in right now. If I can actually be brought over there this time. That is convenient. And there's another one. Let's get it. Now, 35 to get to level 3. As far as I know, level 3 is the highest. Um, and it's not 35 all at once. I guess you've already technically got, what, 15 up to that point. So an extra 20... see honestly could I go can I submerge I don't think you can no you can't hmm I was gonna say if I could go underwater which I don't think you can I'm mashing all the different buttons I like how we're all just kind of swimming together <laughs> I like how determined they look all right let's get going I'll figure out this in a minute it's going to take me a little time. Not every puzzle is going to just pop up and be like instant solve. So we shall uh, struggle a little bit here and there. If I'm not mistaken. Oh, wait, what is this? I like how I fell by accident and I found something. I can't believe it. Another one? Another one. Let's go. It's actually crazy. 18. Let's go. All right, guys, I was kind of just like running around without recording. This is like, what am I missing? You know, and then I finally figured it out. Um, when you come over here, you're looking at this door. This is obviously the right path to go. We're right next to the Forgotten Forest. And I saw this glowing up there, and I was like, well, I didn't see that before. Let me just shoot it. And it does like a little beam. Now, that's as far as I got. I'm hoping that means it goes to the next one. We'll see. So I had the right idea about shooting these. Okay. Now I can do this. Alright, let's get it. Forgotten Forest. Oh no. This <laughs> sounds scary. No one knows the true age of these shrines. The people who built them have long been forgotten, but their work still remains. Watching over the forest like ancient guardians. Taro's spirit has corrupted the shrines. And sealed the entrance to the guardian tree. I can feel Taro's presence there. I've marked the shrine locations on your map. Thank you, Rusu. I'll work to clean the shrines. All right, that was perfect. Okay, I was trying to find a good stopping point. I was like, I don't want to stop until I figure this out. Uh, now that we got the shrine underway, or the shrine hunt, if you would, these are all the ones that are marked. All right. We come back next time. We'll be doing this. We got this is locked for some reason. I guess that's like a blocked path, maybe. All right, guys, that is it for now. Thank you so much for watching. If you want more of this game, just destroy that like button. I'll kind of see how the first few videos do. Kind of go from there. You guys are awesome. Take it easy.